Good afternoon. This is Flying Shout Feed Eagles speaking. Yes, this is my update to you from Feed Eagle Flying Eagle, Flying Eagle Child. Yes, I've been very busy, so I didn't have a chance to do some videos yesterday. But I'll be doing a good update for the summer thing I've been doing all summer long. That's still another day, a month of summer. But take it day by day. But yes, this is Flying Shout Feed Eagle speaking. So, my first update is I'll be making more updates for Dragon Story. I'm on level 79 now. Got a really cool dragon. So that what I excite. Then you can see I'm right beside my studio. And you can see right there my, my costumes. I fixed them up. Redone uh redone uh I got that one finished up, so I'll be working on some dancing videos too. So yes, uh, been do, went to Edmonton, so pretty quick you'll be seeing some Edmonton blogging videos. I tried doing a storm video the other day, but it didn't work out so well because a uh, little bit of video issues uh, with thinking what I can use for it. But the good news is I am still active and I probably will for a long time. Cludy and I have been on since 2012. And yes, uh, I, I'm not on a third party, so I'm going to let YouTube team know I'm not on a third party. I'm not on a ad rev. I tried it, but uh, just letting you know, YouTube team, I, I, I'm pretty sure I aired it up, but sorry about that. But I'm just going to just keep it off. But thank you for letting me know about my account and stuff. So they just let me know that uh, if I'm on a third party, if I'm, if I'm not going to apply for AdWords, so I said, I'm, I'm okay. I'm not going to keep it how, how I did these videos for long. But that's good. And for the uh, and for the copyright things. But that's good. Appreciate their nice words to me. I really appreciate that. And I'll just keep on going with what I'm usually doing with my videos. In the music, I'm really respecting with the owners I'm with. So those are what I'm usually doing. But anyways, my next update is... Now my hair is getting longer, I lost a bit of weight, got some new glasses, and I found out that styles are coming back again. So I just seen that the 90s and 80s will be coming back. So that's going to be quite exciting. So that's why you see bigger glasses, because that's the trend of mid-2017. Next year, 2018, you'll see some quite interesting trends, if you are if you know what the old soul meaning of. So the old soul is... People that are liking styles that never tried before and you really want to see how it is. I know it's kind of cheesy these days, but it, it's a cycle, so styles will come back. Even the 50s might even come back, or music of rock and roll, pop, funk, will come back. So in time, it is mixed up right now. So this is my one of my bustles. I've been working on that for a while. You'll see right there. I'm going to just do it. Those are, that's all my, I finished that. I finished my hoop up there, so that's all finished. I got all that done, then... I worked on my headdress, and those are my outfits right there, and there's my eagle and griffin outfit. I had that griffin outfit for a long time, because that's a very nice one. It wasn't cheap at all. But, the problem is, I've been, uh, had a few messages from a furry person before, and I said I don't do things like that. I do because I want to just try it and see how it is. I don't do it outdoors unless if it's an event, sporting event. People can misunderstand if I'm a furry or not. No, I'm not a furry, but I like... Cosplays. I call them co well, furry cosplays. Problem is with furries is I get a little embarrassed. I was following INO 98777 and that is Telephone. She's from Los Angeles down in California. So I just found out that she's a furry too. So no, not me, but she's their furry on her. But the cool thing about the Canadian ones is it is quite quieter than the ones in America, because everybody wants to be an animal, right? But yes, i tell you why you see my, well, eagle name. Yes, I'll finally explain about that. Yes, my native name is Flan Eagle Child. That's the given native name given me from my Goko, because I am First Nation. I'm a full Aboriginal Cree from the Musquatchee tribes in Alberta, Canada. So maybe the Americans don't even know I'm a, I'm a Canadian. I deeply love Americans because I've been down there. Well, my brother did, but he. It, it's fun because, you know, I'm not into politics. I don't, I'm not into the bad things. Like, I want the world to be peaceful. I want every country to be peaceful. That's why I respect and love everyone in the world. That's why I say God bless you all. 
you know, I, I'm hoping things get better with the world too. There is a lot of issues in Americans, but I deeply, really respect that. And I, I know how that feels, how hard that for some people going through these crazy people these days. So I'm going to say, I love you too, USA. And I'm actually related to you, to you Americans. So that's pretty cool. I'm related to some of them. So, some of you guys. Well, we're all related. We're all equal. We're, we're never top or below each other. You know, you know, the, doesn't matter. Like, I'll tell you one thing about videos too. I like getting attention, but this is how I am. I've been like that for a long time. And you probably see my, this is actually my old look. I looked like this in 2014. But you see, if you check out Charlotte and Tom, that's my channels too, you will see the, the exact look coming. I had no glasses, so I'll pretend. So this is my 2014 look. I would look like this. But for the 2017 look, I look like this again. So kind of like 2014 and 2015. But my mom cut off of my hair. So, eh, what the heck? <laughs> but yes, I'm hoping I get down to uh, California. I want to check out Los Angeles because the cool thing about Los Angeles is that's where YouTube team is. But, I'm joking. Everybody knows where, where YouTube team is. But I want to see how the studio looks like. I've never seen what the studio looks like, but it's probably big. But I've known that some places down in America are so cool. Like, because my brother went to New York and he's seen a lot of cool stuff, including the ones in uh, Anaheim. And actually, I'm a big fan of the Pittsburgh Penguins. I know someone will hate that, but the problem is, I'm a Canadian fan. So I'm an Ottawa and an Edmonton Oilers and a Red Deer Rebel fan. So I'm kind of mixed up. So if, I'll probably, you'll probably see me wear a variety of jerseys. But the problem is, my jerseys aren't cheap because they are worth about one or $280 to $1,500 bucks, or even $2,000. Because some of my jerseys are game ones. So, yeah. So, soon in time, when I get my money spent again, I'll be getting some more costumes. Like those really pricey ones I got. Those are ones I really love. I always wear them, but the summer right now, it is very hot. Yes, the day before, it was plus 34 degrees Celsius. But today's a little cooler. It's only about 27, 28 at the highest today. So I'm going to give a big shout out to all my subscribers or anyone that's been following me for a bit of time. I give a very big thank you. And very big thank you to YouTube team for supporting me with the free initialized channel that I've been on for a while. So I give a thanks and, you know, that I'm doing my things right for you guys. But yes, I am a very kind guy. So I don't like being angry, but sometimes I am. But, but yes, um, I will be 22 in November 30th. That would be this upcoming year, 2017. Crazy years go by. But yes, if you see my first video, it was published in early mid 2000, uh, what was it, 2012. So if you check Sheldon Luan visiting, that's me when I was 16 years old. Now I'm 21. But I had the same voice, but just a slightly a little younger. If you heard my brothers, if you see, well, I, the problem is why I keep my subscriptions and all my all my subscri uh, 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 subscribers quiet because recently when I had to do that, uh, it gets a little annoying. So I'm not done being rude, I just don't like counting subscribers. But if I had a bit, just for example, I'll keep them off too. And I always keep my playlist private, just because of purposes, that's why. But I will do it if, if I feel comfortable doing it, then you'll see what I like. But mostly it's... But the cool thing is, I'll tell you one thing what I am doing. You know why I'm looking at this? Because I am a traditional dancer. I follow powwow. So usually when I'm on YouTube, but I search things, I'll probably search about powwow dancing, uh, YouTube vloggers, or reactions. I do reaction videos. So I can do, like, look at the powwow stuff and dance. I do dancing if there is a community one, because I don't travel much as I used to because it's, uh, I get so busy on my working from my home and for the things I like to do around common in the local area because there is a lot of stuff in the local area in Alberta. Rosh Al Museum, Edmonton Zoo, West Edmonton Mall. I'm in the heart of Alberta so that's where everybody knows what West Edmonton Mall is. It's a very rebidey and popular mall that's been around since the early 1980s. So yes, this is my update to you guys. I am deeply appreciated for subscribes. If anyone loses me whatever with some subscribers, that's okay. It's, uh, everybody's different with videos because I follow other YouTubers that are like me but worse. I actually follow Tarmix, but I found out when I was listening to one of his videos, his um, channel was actually doing pretty successful. 
I unsubscribe because I get so much. So I kind of just unsubscribe a bit and I go back on and go off and back on and off. But I'll still be following him because I do videos with him too, like YouTube poop videos or YTP. Because the cool thing is that I like him, but the problem is some videos aren't pretty nice. They are offensive. So I kind of just don't like them. I look at them and some of it is funny, but I ignore the ones that are really offensive and actually racist. So I just don't worry about that. But anyways, moving on from negativity from that, the little things. Yes. Um, what else do I should say? I've been walking lately. I've been getting collections for more new feathers, eagle feathers, hawk, vulture, condor, all kinds. Getting some more of this. I'm actually collecting more jerseys, so I'll be doing more jersey videos when I get. I'm actually thinking of purchasing it. I didn't do this month because I purchased more eagle feathers and stuff. But I did. Um, um, to be getting the away jersey game ward of Matt Cassian, number 28. He was from. He's on Edmonton now, but I think he is. I don't know. Someone told me that. Uh, I don't know. But he was on Ottawa in 2012 until 2014. So he got shifted to another team. So I didn't check that out. But yes, this is Flying Shots, Speed Eagle speaking, and glad you enjoyed the update. And if there's new ones, welcome. But if it's a little too much, you don't have to follow. But it's okay. I'll tell you one little funny quote for our subscribers. Sometimes it comes and goes. So that means that sometimes subscribers will come onto a channel, but when it gets weird or awkward or whatever what they say, they unsubscribe. Then it comes back with others and they'll go. Then it comes back and it goes. That's how it is with YouTube. I've never seen YouTube since 2005 when I was 11 years old. I was still remembered when I was still playing with, what was it, strangeland.com. That's what I used to watch when I was a young kid, including, there's a few websites before YouTube and Facebook that came in, so I remember using those to watch videos. It's QuickTime, but for ones that don't know what QuickTime is, it's way older than today's video production uh, qualities because those times is when how best the technology was in the early 2000s late 1990s but today it's actually quite better but yes glad you guys enjoyed my update and see you guys soon this is Sheldon Tom my real name my native, ta native name is Flying the Child and my YouTube name originally is Feed Eagle so have a guys have a good day press a like if you do and say hello or whatever say whatever you want and we can have a good chat or whatever but yes, it's a fine job, Geek speaking. Have a good day, night, or whatever what time you're in. Blessings to you all, and God bless you all, and have a beautiful, blessed life. Fine speaking.